What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Fresh Tofu, and today we've got Shiny's Key with his comeback MV, I Wanna Be. Shiny is one of my all time favorite groups. So, definitely top three material, and really the reason why, or one of the big reasons why I got back into K pop to begin with. Now, although he is not my bias or my bias record, he is definitely a cherished member of the group. I love him to death, and really, he is one of the reasons why Shiny is as great as they are. Really looking forward to this MV, because, you know, Key, Shiny, great stuff there. But not only that, we got my girl, Soya. She is my bias of idol, and she is featuring on this MV. So, yeah, yeah, I expect I expect uh, what would have been what would have been already a great MV to be taken to the next level with Soya featuring. Um, but anyway, without further ado, let's get this thing started. All right, here we go. <laughs> Rocking them tats. All right. Oh my God, rolling with the mullet. Man, I swear, idols are the only dudes on the planet that can rock a mullet and not look ridiculous. Oh, that was nice. Man, he looks so much skinnier than he did when I first came across them. Like, I saw Shiny back in 2015. It was my first time seeing them. And he looks like he lost so much weight. I mean, it wasn't like he was, like, overweight back then. Like, he looked fit. It's just he looks way skinnier now than he did back then. It, it could be what he's wearing, too. I don't know. Here we go. Here comes my bias. Oh my god, you're looking so bad, Soyan. Oh man. Key with them vocals, too. Yeah, Shiny was so smooth with them vocals. I don't know what they are. They still are so smooth. Alright, nice little choreo piece right here. Pretty, pretty simple stuff with the choreo, but I mean, they're doing it well. Okay, as I say, it was simple choreo. He, he stepped it up a bit. Nice little spin right there. Yeah, very colorful outfits in this MV. <laughs> I like that move right there. Oh, here we go, girl. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Gosh, she looks so good. I love her outfit, too. And so and she's been doing so much like collabs with like other artists lately she's really getting out there i think other companies are recognizing how talented she is but anyway back to our main man god it looks so sharp just kind of grooving that was a nice little image Okay, a little bit of step right there. Yeah, not the most complex choreo. I mean, he, he, I never really thought of him as like the strongest dancer, so I didn't expect anything wild, but definitely nothing on like human level. Right? You know, it's like fun choreo. It's a fun piece of choreo. It, it goes with the song well. I mean, he's not trying to be like sexy or anything like that. He's not trying to like groove or like kind of move with like, you know, the way Taman does. But, you know, the choreo they do right now, it works for the song. Just like kind of fun, kind of bouncy. A lot of like micro changes in levels as well. So like a lot of the bending of the knees, a lot of like raising the hands up. He picked, okay, he, as I'm talking about this, he picked the choreo. Okay. <laughs> it went from fairly beginner choreography to like something more advanced. Ooh, I like that bit. I love the two in front right there. A little bounce. Okay. All right. Man, I'm, I'm here like talking about how like, She's kind of like easing it up on the choreo, and then they, you know, he's like, I got you, fam, I'm about to hit it hard. Nice. All right, oh, that lime green kind of does something to my eyes, but nice. Very nice. I just want to get to the end part right here, where um, he basically takes the choreo to another level. Like, the choreo up until this point was pretty basic, to be entirely honest, it was pretty basic stuff, but at the very end here, he picks it up. Like, a lot of changes in levels, and some great footwork. Like, right there, that was such sick footwork, and I really wish they had zoomed out at that point. They zoomed in too much, so you didn't see it. So, I guess I'll have to wait to the stage or for the dance practice to see it, but... That last little piece right there, I love like that, not, not right there too, but... Like, earlier, the footwork was looking all kinds of sharp. I loved it. It was very advanced stuff, and I really wish I could have seen it, but they zoomed in to focus on key, because, you know, it's the man. But yeah. Great MV. Not bad at all. So yeah, that was Key's I Wanna Be. And I gotta say, two thumbs up from this guy. 
you know, it was a fun song. The choreo, although not as advanced, at least not to the very end, it fits the song well. You know, it was a very bouncy kind of song. You know, not too many crazy changes in levels. Uh, great footwork at the end. So yeah, just kind of like a fun song to go with a fun piece of choreo. Um, and yeah, you got my girl Soya, my bias from Idol, you know, featuring. And she did great. She looked great. And uh, yeah, it's so cool to see her feature more with like SM. Because I thought she did a great job when she paired up with Solgi from Red Velvet, uh, Cindy from G Friend, and Chunga. Like they had their little collaboration a few months back for uh, Station Zero. I think that's SM's like, you know, collab station. And it was so cool to see. And it's just so cool to see SM bring her back again for some more work with Keith. Um, but anyways, uh, thanks for checking me out, you guys. If you like what you see, go ahead and hit that like button. If you like some more, subscribe. If you have any recommendations or just any comments on what I've had to say, leave a comment down below, and I'll check it out. But yeah, uh, thanks again for checking me out, and I'll see you guys next week. Take it easy.